Hey, Jim here. And this is not Jim. This is Jim. Anyway, <laughs> that's kind of funny, but not really. Uh, anyway, so folks, Harley brake line, Harley brake system, Harley brake everything. Started out with a little rattle. I needed a dust cover. Well, okay, so pulled stuff apart. Thought, all right, we should put some brakes on there because those brakes are kind of skinny. The motors. Okay, hold on here. I have to cough. <coughs> oh, Lord. Anyway, so then we go to the brakes. Then we go to fixing the brakes. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Video, video. So this is the maybe the last one. I'm kind of hoping. So uh, anyway, put your folks down so you can kind of see what's going on here. And get you in there a little closer. That's pretty good, right? right oh, I don't know. Is that good? Not gonna. Doesn't like being that close, I don't think. All right. So anyway, see that? <coughs> I saw um, in another video I did. Um, somehow this brake line is supposed to be tucked in underneath here, right? So, but it was flat and scraped right the heck out. I don't know how it could. I know this was in an accident before. You know, we got a little bit of this monkey business here, and then you know some down here too. You know, and the bar's a little bit crooked and a couple of chippies on this side. And Anyway, but how, because it's inside, did it get scraped like that, I wonder? I just don't know, and it was flattened out. Showed it to you in the other video. Maybe I'll uh, have that in there. I've had a lot of a mess of videos lately that are just goofy. Anyway, so the big plan now is I put this one on, cut it off. I put the, it's a, the, called the Union, and then uh, there's this little feral thing. Oh, what the heck are we here? This little feral thing that goes on there. But that feral thing goes on after the, I suppose, you, here, I should show you the slip nut, you know. And then the, this part here scrunches it coming in this way here. But uh, when I cut out the piece, it was just a little too, too long there, the cut. I figured maybe with the, um... You know, the distance you have to go in there that I might be okay. Well, see what happens when you think. Alright, so, here you go, what I have now. I don't know, I'll have to, have to weigh you guys, I think, this time, yeah. Alright, so, what I ended up with is a guy down at the, uh, it's a copper line. Someone returned it. He's a funny guy, because it has a bubble on one end, and it didn't work for whatever he did, or he was trying to do, or something. Anyways, but see, when he returned it, ah, he made his own. There's no bubble there. Anyway, so, uh, copper tubing. And this is the 316, just like my other line. It's not going to match, but I don't care. So, what I do is I'm going to take out a chunk of this, get it in position with my other, uh, let's see, I have another one, see? Another one of them uh, unions. So, <coughs> I'll figure it out a little bit here. And then when I uh, start my assembly process and all, I'll do it and we'll do it together. And then we can uh, probably start bleeding the brake this next time maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, thanks a lot for stopping by. It's a nice day here. A little too cool this morning. I had to put pants on. Uh-oh, winter's coming. Anyway, uh, thanks for stopping by. Subscribe, like, uh, don't like, uh... Tell your friends, tell your friends I suck and then give them the whole address thing like that so they can come and see, <laughs> you know where I'm going. Thanks a lot. Bye now.